Hi, I'm Craig Lounsbro. How will the world be different because you were here? Do you ever ask yourself that? I have many times. Look, you won't leave the world the same way that you found it. In whatever way and to whatever degree that you do it, you're going to leave the world different. Now, whether that's better or worse, well, it's up to you. But you're going to leave the world different. But you know, a lot of people have a hard time believing that they can actually make things different. And that's sad because you were created to make things different. And I think that a lot of people have a hard time with that because they really don't see themselves as being powerful enough or important enough or smart enough or whatever it is that they feel they need to be enough of to make any change. In their minds, they're really not all that influential. They really don't matter all that much. They're just a blip on the screen of history. And so they're just kind of doing life until the doing is done. Changing things, making real change, well, that's for other people. Look, changing things is not for other people, whoever those other people happen to be. Changing things is everyone's job. Don't think it's not. And each of us have some set of resources that we've been gifted with, whether those are large or whether those are small, that we can use to change things. You are an agent of change. That's your job. You are important. You have power. Maybe a lot, maybe a little, but you've got some. In some way, you have influence. You're here to make the world different, to make it better. And you possess the resources to do that. Now, when it comes to change and being reminded that I have a role in it, I always find inspiration in this. God says this to you and to me. You're included in this. It reads this way. For I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord, plans to prosper you and not to harm you, plans to give you a hope and a future. Plans. God's got a plan for you and he knows exactly what it is. That's what he says. And he says it in more than just one place. A plan for you. Something that you're supposed to do that's a whole lot bigger than you can imagine yourself doing. God says that you're a game changer. You. That's the plan. Now, what that plan is and how that works itself out in your life, well, that's between you and God. But he's got a plan for you. And if God has a plan for you, if God actually created a plan for you, then how would you not want to be part of that? Look, I don't know what your attitude about life is, or how you feel about your role in life, or if you even believe that you have a role. I don't know if you believe in God or not. I don't know how you view any of that. But God says you've got a role, a role to make things better. You've got a place in all of this, a job to do. In other words, you're important. Look, go pray about it. Read your Bible or get one if you don't have one. Talk to a pastor. Go to church. Find a Christian podcast. Listen to Christian music. Consider that maybe there's a God and maybe he's actually got a plan for you. And once you do that, then be brave enough to follow it because it's going to be pretty cool. And if you do, the world will be better because you did. And you might think about how making the world better will make you better as well.